Hello lads and lasses, boys and girls, welcome back to some more Sky Factory. Uh, this is episode number two. I hope you guys are going to be enjoying this series as much as I am enjoying this mod pack. Um, basically, we're going to start straight off by doing the basics and everything like that. And yeah, that's what we're basically going to do this episode. Um, my PC is still warming up, so it is going to be pretty glitchy from now and then. Because it's still warming up, because I'm not. I'm just turned it on. Uh, so yeah, uh, we're gonna get back to the old shenanigans where we just um, keep twerking for these trees to grow. Obviously, um, we're hopefully gonna get some decent stuff. For example, cobblestone. Um, what's the other thing called? Cobblestone, there's gravel, there's everything like that. We're just gonna hopefully get that today. I'm only gonna keep spamming shift, which would be much, much better. Anyway, I just turn my microphone to the side. And yeah. Also, I'm not gonna do a. Oh, sorry about that. Just hit my drawers. Well, not my drawers, my desk for some reason, by accident. Um, but I'm just gonna say one thing. Basically, I am looking to actually do a setup video in the future. I don't know if I mentioned this last episode or not, but I'm planning on doing a setup video. So if you guys want to actually see this um, the setup video, all you need to do is leave some comments and leave a like on this video. Also, just every video, well not every video, just like this video alone, basically just put a comment saying you're looking forward to it and stuff like that. Also, I'm planning on bringing something new to the channel, like Q&As. Like a Q&A Sunday kind of thing, because I do generally nothing on a Sunday, generally. I just basically go out, watch whatever I play football. And that's basically it. <clears throat> Alright, we're just going to wait until these decide to grow. Which is going to take a long, long time. So, yeah. Hello. Are you going to grow? Um, also, another thing that I'm bringing that Look at that. This is because my PC is warming up. It's actually starting to lag a lot. This is not generally... like It doesn't generally happen. With my PC warming up, um, it's starting to do that like pretty much like every so often. And I think I've got the main on. No, I don't. Damn it. Right. So I'm just going to turn some of the settings down. I have got a low settings because I knew this was going to happen with my PC when it was warming up this morning. Look at this man, let's just keep on lagging because my PC is still warming up. Which is annoying because I don't want it to warm up. Well I do, but I don't want it to like affect the bloody lag thing that's happening now. So we're just going to chop some more trees down, which we have an absolute big tr massive tree here. Um, so yeah. Uh, I've been doing a lot of research on like sky factories and stuff like that myself just having a look of like how you can do certain stuff and like what stuff you need to make like the cobblestone and everything like that so basically to make cobblestone you need something called a sieve and then from that sieve you get dirt which is made up of like putting saplings in the oak barrels and then from there Basically, that compost and a dirt, and then after that, as soon as you get that dirt, you just put it in the sieve. Keep on clicking on the sieve. The sieve will sieve it down, and then that's even a word. And then it'll turn into stone little particle things. And then after them stone little particles, you can basically put them in a crafting um, table, and basically you can then turn them into um, what we're gonna call cobblestone well it's cobblestone I don't know what I'm on about so if I show you now I hit this and then there's cobblestone there it's already researched hit R on it and then there you go you get these I don't know if it's actually dot on for every time but it possibly is see that there compressed cobblestone you get nine units of that one but this yeah turns into cobblestone and then you can start getting upgrades and everything like that. just keep going and keep going and keep going it's a lot of fun actually. I love this mod pack so much. Um, 
it's not a massive massive requirement mod pack it's like an average for PCs um, main at the minute yes it is having little lag spikes that is because it is just warming up I literally have just turned it on like literally a second ago which like I decided I would go straight up and record and um, because yeah I'm gonna start that's another update that I need to actually do basically this is another thing that I'm gonna see in this video and in the channel update which will be coming in the next week or so maybe on the weekend actually I'm not too sure um, but the channel update just gonna see another bunch of stuff about how the channel's gonna be like well not how the channel's gonna be like what's gonna be going on on the channel like if I'm gonna be putting new like games up which I'm planning on doing um because at the minute I can only record through the ps4 and I literally can't I can't actually like use my Elgato anymore because mine is the old Elgato so I'm actually hoping to get a new Elgato for my birthday which is a mission right from now but if possible I might just try and get the videos that I record on the PS4 software thing and send them like a different website like send them like Facebook or something take it off Facebook and like put some commentary over it but yeah, if you would like to see some gameplay on next gen, all you need to do is let me know in the comment section below. That's another thing. Um, because I do have a lot of games like Battlefield 4, Minecraft, like normal. Minecraft, Battlefield 4, FIFA. Um, what else do I have? Advanced Warfare. Is that it? Uh, let me just check now. Let me just check now. FIFA, Minecraft, Advanced Warfare, Battlefield 4. And I think that's possibly it. So yeah. So now I'm actually gonna make a oh what's it called again? Sip. There we go. So to make a sip. Nope. Oh. oh what am I doing? Right, sip. To make a sip basically you need oak wood planks, sticks on either side the same, and silk mesh. So basically silk mesh is made up of string and if you don't know how to get string basically um if I can show you very very soon um uh, which I'm hoping to do um in Babylo you should be able to actually make some sort of oh wait there, give me a second, let me just make a crook. There we go. Right, I don't know if I actually have vein miner on. I'm not too sure. Right. So then you can just chop this tree down. And basically you will get something called a silkworm. Which you can actually right click on a tree. That silkworm will go into that tree and start like. Putting loads of silk in it. I can't remember the real name for that. <laughs> Forgot all about that. But I actually did make a world where I'm just playing it by myself, like I am now, but it's going to be like a world that I'm just going to learn the basics on, off camera, how to build this normal stuff. I know on the other world that I've got, basically, you can make a cobblestone, like, miner for yourself, so basically, oh, I forgot what they're called again. I'll have to have a look into that again, but you can actually make a, um thing on this mod pack where it actually mines the cobblestone for you you don't actually see it mining the cobblestone you just see the cobblestone just going into the actual chest thing itself and you can just see it all mounting up uh, which is absolutely amazing that the um, creator of this mod pack has actually done getting that mod in there which is absolutely crazy so we don't have to spend all ep like all of one episode just mining a big bunch of bloody cobblestone and here we go we actually did get a silkworm and as you see, it's moving. You can't see my hand anymore. The silkworm's moving. It's a bit creepy. You can see it moving in the inventory section. And we're just going to click here. And as you see, it is in for a little bit. I can't even say words. But yeah, it's doing that process there. Um, in Investing. Investing. Oh my god, my words are. I'm actually losing all my words for some reason. It's annoying us now. Uh, well, I'm not losing all my words. I've just literally not long woken up, so I'm I am really tired, which is no good. Rich is really no good. 
also I have took a little bit of a break like normal because I like to take breaks and like get on with some revision for exams and stuff but now most of them are out the way I have literally got one left Um as soon as that's out the way we can just start getting into making maybe two videos every week maybe more than that if you guys will enjoy them and um, basically if we hit like a five like target or something in that one week um well in that one video we'll basically upgrade to three videos a week and so on so that'll be crazy i know i am a little small channel but at the end of the day if i can actually hit five likes that is absolutely awesome you know I know it's like nothing compared to huge YouTubers where they set like 2,000 like like cha challenges, targets, whatever you want to call them. Yeah, I'm not going to be like that. I wouldn't like set big, big goals for that um, because, yeah, I if I was a big channel, maybe I would hit that. But being a channel like this, I'll know when you'll hit that unless like my channel goes bombarded with loads of people who like joining it, um, which would be absolutely amazing just to see a uh, loads of people watching the videos that I like to do um like literally I am like um considering doing a Q&A and I know probably well I've already been asked this a bunch of times of a bunch of people that I've uh, met online and basically they're asking what inspires me to what well, what actually inspired me to do YouTube and I'm not going to answer this in this video. I'm going to answer it when I do the Q&A. Um, that is because, yeah, the Q&A is obviously for the question and answers. Uh, which we actually want questions to answer in that video. We don't want to just be sitting there doing nothing. Also, in that video, if we actually have a HD webcam, I am possibly going to do face cam. Maybe. Possibly. I'm not too sure. But that could be a thing. That could happen. That's only if you guys would actually like to have face cam in videos from time and time again. And yeah. And that would be cool. That would be really cool. And I'm going to make some more sticks. Right, we're just going to break them up into pieces. And there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Just going to make a bunch of crooks. And we can put the sticks back down there like this. Put all the crooks in there like that. And I'm going to actually set a vi Oh, did a wrong mistake there but I'm actually gonna set up a vein minor um thing off camera because yeah it's a lot of work to, well it's not a lot of work to do on camera I just don't want to really do it on camera because yeah we want to get on cracking with stuff and everything like that and yeah we're gonna start just keep on thinning these trees and hopefully when we get vein minor up and running it can actually be a faster process of um actually chopping down the leaves chopping down the trees alone and everything like that I think vein miner is more like ah uh, what was that mod called again? <laughs> I don't really do the timber mod. That's it. Um, basically, I think it's more like that, but it's accessible for more different like it's more blocks uh, that are accessible through it. Like say the timber mod that was only used for wood, obviously, and this one you can actually mine like the likes of leaves. I think you mine the likes of wood. Every block on the planet, I think you can actually like set a tool to mine so much of that. And it hasn't. The good thing about vein miner and what I was panicking about was, is it actually going to be too overpowered and basically go so far in a radius? But it's actually not. Believe it or not, um, it would only go so many blocks. And which is absolutely an awesome thing, which I actually like about this mod pack itself. Basically, that's what that does, and it's it's just amazing. That's I think I am going to. And it was like me lagging there for a second with my voice, but I actually wasn't because I was just trying to think of stuff. But I'm actually thinking about doing a lot of different games and a lot of fun, fun, fun games. And hopefully, if you guys have got some suggestions, all you need to do is leave a comment um, down below and let me know what kind of games you would actually love to see on this channel. Because I do know a couple of games in mind that I want to do on this channel, but I'm just like getting back into YouTube because I have took a long break because of like Christmas exams coming straight up after the Christmas and stuff like that. I wanted to focus a lot on them and yeah, get them out of the way because yeah. 
that's how I like to do things because there's no good stressing over YouTube wanting to get a video out like as often as possible when you have exams because yeah you possibly um could get a bad mark in your exam if you don't revise so that's the one thing you always want to keep in mind if you want to do exams so just go and revise I don't know how like daft that sounds but yep yeah, it's the truth um, I'm just going to put a bunch more of these in here there we go and there we go and there we go that was perfect right now we're going to eat up and this is slowly but surely investing, infestating, or whatever you want to call it. I am losing words so much now. I, I'm just, I feel daft because, like, I'm trying to say words that I literally can't say because I've literally woken up a second ago. Well, not literally a second ago, like, I would say about 10, 15 minutes ago. But, yeah, I'm still not fully awake. So, yeah, that's the problem. Right, as soon as this tree's done, we're going to start, like, putting some stuff down and everything like that. For first things first, though, we're going to actually make a chest, um, just to store away some items that we don't actually need right this second. So, first things first, we're going to store away all these books. We'll keep these crooks on because we need them. We're not going to need the wood yet. We're not going to need this yet. Not going to need the sticks yet. Not going to need the axe yet. Possibly not going to need the dirt yet. Oh god, bit of a yawny there, yawny, 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 right, actually we're not going to even need the silkworm yet, so we'll just order these crooks up in um, order, we're going to wait until this decides to do its thing, these are these are more dirt done, perfect, I'm hoping for it to rain soon and also we can get some water, then we can do a bunch of things with the water and make some cobblestone and stuff. I mean, I already, I don't think you need water for cobblestone anyway. Well, you need it for a cobblestone generator. You don't actually need it for cobblestone itself. So, yeah. Let me just check if all this tree's done. Just keep on checking. Yep, it's all done. So now we can begin mining it. Well, not mining it. Cutting it off a um, string. And we've got one piece of string, two pieces of string, three, four, five, six... Seven, eight. Is there nine? There's nine. There's a tenth. Eleven. No, that's a sapling. There's a twelfth. Oh, look at this! Look at this! We're getting tons of string, which is absolutely awesome. Right, come on. We need to keep on doing this. Keep on doing it. Keep on doing it. Keep on doing it. Keep on doing it until we fall. Keep on falling up. Keep on filling up. There we go. And it's done. We got five silkworms out of that tree. And we got 20... Is that 23? That's 23 string. So now we're going to begin making some cobblestone and stuff like that. I'm actually going to show you the cobblestone process and how it is actually done. At first things first, that's going to be that. And yeah. So we'll fill this one up. Which is done. Um, so the, make the... Right, we need to make something once again called silk mesh and to make that we need the full string in here so we're going to make one silk mesh and two silk mesh so then boom there we go now if we just turn these wood into this I think we could possibly have enough sticks and wood right now in our inventory so it's going to go like this the silk mesh in the middle you're going to have the sticks either side down here and then you kind of wood no it's not like that the sticks at the bottom and then the wood and then boom we have an oak sieve which is absolutely crazy because now we're making absolute huge progress and um, so yeah so we'll get this silk and put them in there we'll get the oak sieve and we're gonna plunk it directly here and I'll forget this oak barrel get this dirt out yeah we'll just hide this dirt in yeah as you see it goes into the sieve and if we keep on clicking right click on this as you see that thing there that is 33% left keep doing that and then look we get stone which is absolutely crazy so we can get our dirt once again and we're gonna just punch a but um, buttload in here 
So we'll just keep on doing this until we have loads of stone. And there we go. We've got 13 stone little particle things, whatever you want to call them. And boom! We have three pieces of cobblestone. We've made progress already. That's absolutely awesome. And yeah, we have another one of these. So we're going to actually get the silkworm out straight away in seconds. Get the silkworm, plonk it straight inside this tree. Get that doing its business. And yeah, that's coming to the end of the episode. We haven't done a bunch of stuff on the island right now of expanding. We're basically just doing a bunch of stuff where we're getting into the cobblestone process and stuff like that. So anyway guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed this second episode of this video. This has been an absolute awesome episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed this as much as I have. And basically, all I wanted to say is leave some comments down below of some future games I could include in this. If you would like to see some next gen uh, gameplay, but it won't. Some videos might not actually even have commentary in them, so I'll be sorry about that. But um, if you want to see next gen gameplay, please be sure to let us know. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys next time, please be sure to leave a thumbs up, also, like always, please be sure to leave some comments like I've just said before, and yeah, thanks for watching, stay safe and come back and enjoy this series next time, goodbye and I'm out.